All right, Taylor, part two. Improper fractions. So I have 14 thirds. What I'm gonna do to convert that into a mixed number is to do illustrations again. So I'm gonna, I know that I'm cutting my picture into threes. So I'm gonna come down here, and this time I think I'm just gonna draw squares. And I'm gonna draw one, two, three to start. So I wanna cut these into thirds, and I'm hoping that I can do this at the same time. One, two, three, one, two, three. And please don't pay attention to the fact that these are not the same size. So when I look at this, I want to count because I'm looking at how many I have with the 14. I want to count how many pieces I have. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I know that I need 14. So I'm going to draw two more to see if that helps me. And sometimes it might be all about trial and error or whatever works for you. So now I'm going to count this again and I'm going to color in three. So it gives me three pieces or this is three pieces or one whole this one gets colored in this is three pieces or one whole this one gets colored in this is three pieces or one whole another way I might do this is I might go this is three six nine so we color in three more this is three pieces one whole or mix 12 and now I'm two away from having 14 so I color in two more this gives me 14 two pieces or two thirds so what I want to do now is that's another step I want to add them up so I have one two three four holes and two thirds so two holes and four thirds and two four and two thirds sorry equals 14 thirds as improper